previously taken O-Learn. You've gone to your professor and reminded them to look for the Y in the O-Learn column, and they found there is not a Y. The next thing that you can try is by looking at your past enrollments in Canvas, and I'm going to show you how to do that. So first, you're going to navigate to your dashboard in Canvas. Then, you're going to find on the left-hand side, Courses, and click that. Now, if you're like me and you have several courses in your uh, Canvas dashboard, it's going to require that you scroll down. And all the way at the bottom, there's going to be a link called All Courses. You'll click that. Now, if you notice the orange stars, those are the classes that I can actually see on my dashboard. If I scroll down, I'll eventually see Past Enrollments. If I continue to scroll down, I'll be able to find all of the past classes that I've had. Oh, I found an OLearn course. Now, I can click on that OLearn course, and then just like I would if I was in the class, there should be on the left-hand side a link for grades. Once I find my grades and confirm that I've passed the class with an 80% or above, I can take a screenshot of that and submit that to my professor to prove that I have completed OLearn. Sometimes the Y in the OLearn column malfunctions and it doesn't always appear. So this may be a way that you have to prove that you've taken OLearn in the past. If that doesn't help, go ahead and move to step three.